everybody and welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, my name is Caitlin and I upload a whole bunch of different videos on this channel, including mystery videos which are back this week. I am filming a new mystery video this week, so there will be one up on Sundays as usual. Today I'm bringing to you a huge Primark haul. Like, I think this might actually be possibly the biggest Primark haul I've ever done. This has accumulated over about three different trips um, to a couple different Primarks, been to Liverpool, Chester, and then also one somewhere else that I can't actually remember. I have everything in this massive white bag, but in reality, it's probably about four or five, five brown bags worth in there. So I'm just gonna get started because this is gonna be very long and I hope you guys enjoy. So since, like I said, everything has been chucked into that one big bag, there is gonna be absolutely no order to this whatsoever. I'm just gonna grab things show them to you so the first thing is probably the least interesting to a lot of you but i found this section this <laughs> section i found this in the like the technology and stationery section in my local primark it was only four pounds and it is just a foam tripod it's like one of these mini little gorilla pods it was only four pounds it adjusts to fit any phone and i just thought this would be great because if you guys haven't already seen i do weekly uni vlogs on my channel which a lot of the time feature mostly just time lapses of me doing work so this is going to be super handy it was only four pounds i thought it was a pretty decent section and primark have really like really impressed me at the moment with their like their stationary section and their technology everything they're really upping their game this year so it's the first thing i bought i'm running out of my yankee candle and i love certain scents but i always seem to only love the certain scents that never gone off and i'm a little bit stingy with candles so when i was in primark I saw this one and um, Harry actually smelled it first and said he really liked it. So I decided just to get this large like Kilmer jar style one for £5 because I figured it will last me while um, my current Yankee candle is running out. So this is the scent number 31 pearl grey pomegranate and fig. Can't even describe what this smells like, it just smells quite fresh. Um, so it's just going to be really nice to keep burning in my room to keep it smelling nice. I picked up two pairs of these sunglasses because I absolutely love them. I thought they just looked like very ray ban -y. I've been wearing these non-stop since I bought this first pair and then I picked up a second one the other day. They're just three pounds, super basic, but I just think they look a lot more expensive than they are. And I bought two just because I know me with sunglasses, I'll lose them or break them and I want these to last me till summer. I literally never buy any other Primark, any other Primark, any other sunglasses but Primark because they're really, really good quality for the price you get them. And I just thought these ones were really cute. They look really good. Okay, moving on to some clothes. I've shown this a few times. If you watch my vlogs, you've definitely seen it. And also on my Instagram, I usually post my outfits on there. So I picked up this pinafore dress. I've been wanting like a plaid, uh, like kind of dungaree dress, pinafore dress. They're super in. This print isn't going anywhere anytime soon. They have them everywhere in New Look. They have them in River Island. Literally, you can find these anywhere. And I just thought, I saw this one was probably like the best price and it's really cute. I had a little bit of a kerfuffle with this one because I did have to size down. It is very just straight, so it was quite oversized on me to get an eight and typically an eight is on the smaller end of what I buy. So I did buy six and it's still a little bit too big. So definitely try uh, try this on in the changing rooms before you buy this because the sizing is a little bit funny as it always is in Primark, but I really love this. I've gotten more than my fair use out of this one and this was 13 pounds. Before I forget, I'm gonna talk about the top I'm wearing. This is from Primark. It's like a shirt uh, shirt. So it's white and it's got like this shirt ruffle at the top. So it's like fitted and then it just goes down into a smock shirt. I love it. I thought it was a little bit different. It's only 10 pounds. I'll do a proper try on clip and everything for you. Uh, yeah, I just thought this was a little bit different, a little bit dressier, and it's really fun to start with some like blue jeans. I'm very excited to start wearing this to uni. So I always find Primark are really good at keeping up to date on their Instagram. They always update their story with like the incoming, like the new and upcoming items that they're bringing in for the following season. Uh, so I saw these on their Instagram a few weeks ago, and ever since then I've had my eye out. Like I've been determined to get them because I love Primark jeans anyway. The sizing is a little bit funny, but if you find the right sort of styles that you then they work wonders, especially for the price. These were £13 and these are their straight leg jeans. They are just straight up and down with the raw hem. And these are so in at the moment, they're so 80s, kind of mum jean style, but like slightly more flattering. And I just think these are so good. These are honestly, these be any other style of jeans I've ever had in Primark that I've raved about. These are my favorite pair of jeans. I've never had a pair of jeans fit me so well. I'm so weirdly proportioned, but they fit so well. So for £13, 
you can't really complain with these and these are like the light wash ones i'm pretty sure they might have a slightly dark wash denim but um i grabbed these i'm thinking of like a striped shirt these will look really cute and very 80s so absolute bargain primark jeans are my favorite i picked up this jumper which i fell in love with it was a very on the whim purchase it's quite different for me but i just think it looks like it you could have bought this anywhere else but primark it looks really really well made so it's like this boxy green greeny color yes it's a pure green but i have no idea how to describe the color uh knit jumper it's got like wide sleeves i don't know how to explain it it just sits really nicely and it looks really well made so for 10 pounds i was very impressed with primark with this one and this has been a really fun go-to for spring because it's still gold so it's still a jumper but it uh the color's a little bit different so this was i'm very happy with this purchase actually i have yet to try this on so i don't know how this fits but i got this little plain blue ribbed vest top it's super basic it was three pounds thinking for the summer just for layering even just for like on holiday under the bikinis or something this is just a basic and you can't go wrong with grabbing your basics and prime up early because they always sell out super quick very similar basic theme i've just got this cropped t-shirt it's striped navy white i think i thought just on top of those straight jeans it will look cute again great for layering chuck this under a jumper and it will keep me warm as well so that one was four pounds i wore this top the other day to um a meal with harry's family and it was really really comfy and it just looks i think it looks really cute so it's just a boxy shirt blue and white striped and then it's got these little ruffles on the sleeves and then they're just like really really white sleeves again i'll try it on and this one was 10 pounds as well again very similar to this top i just thought it was quite easy to style but it looks a little bit more expensive so i thought that was a little bit different for me i don't usually wear things like this okay this dress is extremely hard to show you but once again i'll try it on these little like ruffle tea dresses are everywhere and i saw this in the shop window when i walked past in chester i fell in love with it it's got the little as seen in glam magazine sign on it so obviously it's been featured in glamour these are just everywhere they're super flattering i just it was just the color that caught me it was just like a bright orangey red i'm just thinking when it's a little bit hotter it will look so cute with a bright lip on holiday a tan it will just look so good so yep and this one was 13 pounds been very impressed with primark dresses at the moment usually i try and avoid them because their lengths are always quite short but this i'm very happy with i apologize these trainers are really tatty but since buying them i have lived in them i've been wanting a pair of white trainers for so long they're not very white anymore so i need to give them a good wipe down i think these one were 10 pounds i'm pretty sure no 12 pounds sorry and i just think they look a little bit more expensive than they are i know in primark sometimes their shoes can be a bit hit and miss because i feel like they try a little bit too hard to copy some stars like they've got some fake air maxes in there and they just look really really cheaply made but these are so nice and they're really sturdy as well you can tell they're sort of on the nicer made side of primark products so i've been very happy with those white trainers i feel like are just a really fun versatile piece to add to any outfit like i said plaid and gingham are everywhere and they don't look like they're going anywhere at time anytime soon so i sought these i've had my eye on these for a little while and i've never really ventured into the world of clots because like i said i've had quite weird proportions but I tried these on and they were just super comfy. It feels like you're wearing pyjamas. So I got these just plaid collots. They're super basic, they were £10. And they're just really, really fun to start. There's something a little bit different. So if you're feeling a little bit adventurous, um, even just with a plain outfit, they jazz it up a little bit so i thought these were really fun to style i saw these in the shoe section and i fell in love they were on offer from 10 no 16 pounds sorry to six pounds i couldn't resist they are these white pattern booties uh they're just pointed heel pointed toe sorry chunky heel i just fell in love with them you guys know me you know white is my favorite color to style ever and i just thought these would be so fun and as I know, you can style these in some different ways. You can make an outfit look really 90s, even really 60s. It's just going to look so fun to style. Of course, I had to get more cotton pads. I I think I've got about four packets of these. Who knows? Picked up a pair of their little shorts. These are always just really handy to have when the weather starts getting warmer, whether you're going on holiday or not. They're just really easy and flowy to wear. Um, I would recommend maybe if you're in between sizes, go for the smaller size because I am usually in between an 8 and a 10 and I got a 10 and they are a little bit big. They aren't as adjustable on the waist as usual, but these were £4. I just thought this was a really cute colour, mustard. I don't usually wear mustard, but style it with black or white. Yep, super basic. For a little while now, I've been wanting to try and train myself into venturing more into like skirts and dresses because I live in trousers and jeans. It's just always been my comfort zone so like you've already seen i've got a couple of different sort of like dresses and things 
and I decided like denim denim skirts were really like the way to go for me so I went to Primark and picked up this like really nice it's a neutral dark blue wash denim skirt it's actually a really nice length like I said with the dresses I usually struggle with the length of like dresses and skirts in Primark because I'm quite tall so I thought I did think this was going to be quite short but it's actually a really nice length and this one was only eight pounds so I thought that was pretty pretty good deal picked up this skirt which is a little bit different it was also eight pounds so I just thought it was really cute uh, I don't have a plain black skirt so I thought this was sort of something that would be really really handy to have in in my drawers just for like a night out or dinner or something it wasn't like the workwear section so it's a little bit like nicer made and it's just like a black mini skirt it's got like ruffles again like I said these ruffles are everywhere so eight pounds I just thought that was something that was really handy to have I picked up my first bikini of the year and I absolutely love how this fits again Primark sizing just in every way is very hit and miss I love how this one sits on me. It's an essential for me to have to buy separate sets. Like I can't buy a set with everything included. I have to be able to buy a top and a bottom separately. So I picked up this top. It was only £4. I've seen very similar ones in H&M that I fell in love with. They were like £15 for the top and, and £10 for the bottom. So I thought this one was an absolute bargain. It's just a kind of like a little bralette. It comes down a little bit lower so it's less revealing. And there's cups in... And here there's a bit of padding this was only four pounds i just i can't get over it and then the matching bottoms actually fit really nicely i always struggle with sizing of bottoms and they're not too revealing either so they're going to be really comfy and these ones were only three pounds it's a really cute like nude pink color which is really flattering it'll make you look really tanned i bought two of these little tops these were five pounds each they're quite hard to show you um, but they're just going to be great for like beach cover-ups and just a little extra layer they're quite baggy and then you just you just tie them at the front so five pounds i got this blue white stripe one and then a plain black one i actually picked up two of um a pair of a style of jeans they're called body sculpt jeans they were 13 pounds each i'm wearing a pair now and there's a pair in the wash but i'll try and show them in a clip i should be able to film a clip of these ones definitely so i got like a dark wash denim ones that i'm wearing at the moment if you can if you can see and then uh, just a really light wash denim i think they're advertised as sort of like holding everything in and like really sculpting your body but i just i found that they're actually surprisingly um i don't know surprisingly comfy and stretchy which is really nice so they're not too stiff and they're not too loose they're like a mid-rise as well which is a little bit different for me i'm really used to sort of high rise but yeah 13 pounds i'm really really impressed with these jeans and can't really go wrong so apparently i'm just having like a really good time with primark jeans at the moment like i've just been having really good luck with them so I picked these up and these are just the high waist skinny style and I love these they are a little bit tougher but they're great to sort of wear this time of year because they're a little bit thicker so there I wanted like a faded wash black like a slightly acid wash verging on grey pair of black jeans and these ones caught my eye because they have the raw hem they're not super tight which is nice it's a little bit a little bit more comfy so I really like these these ones are only £10 again they're mid-rise but you know me and Primark jeans, this entire video I have just raved about their jeans. And then finally I just have some workout bits, so I got this light blue sports bra, it's just a low impact sports bra, it's only 350 Um I'm not the most well endowed in the chest area, so just basically anything that's comfy and cheap and I just thought this colour was really cute. And then I really really wanted a long sleeve workout top, it's inside out at the moment I think. Um, you'll get the gist. So this one was £7, just a plain black long sleeved top. It's got like some sort of fishnet thing going on in the back and the sleeves, seven pounds. Primark workout gear is my go-to. It's so handy because you can just keep buying more and checking them out when you need to. Very quickly while I'm here, I thought I'd just show you a couple of the bits that I picked up in Forever 21 while I was in Liverpool because you guys know Forever 21 is my favorite place to shop and obviously there's not many shops in the UK. So when I could go into one, I took full advantage of it. So I just picked up a few bits uh, that I thought I would show you. I'm always very impressed with Forever 21 and it's so much easier going into the shop and actually like seeing things in person because then you make sure that they have a nice quality and everything. So first up I just got this really basic top. This was six pounds. I just thought this was gonna be really handy to have like in the summer, just pretty much any time. I'm very much a basic top statement bottoms person. So this sort of thing is like an essential in my wardrobe. So it's just this little sleeveless white ribbed top. It's got a little pep in front of the bottom, which I thought was cute. So six pounds. That's cute and it's not too see-through, which is always a plus. Like I explained about the whole like denim skirt thing, I picked up a white one because I got the blue one in Primark and I also have a black one that's going to be in another haul that I'm going to do 
at uh, some point soon. So I saw this white one, I thought this is so me. You know me in white. Uh, it's like a white kind of denim kind of cord material. It's gonna be really comfy. I got this one in a size medium and it was 15 pounds and I was a little iffy about the sizing because I'm a size small in the tops and the mediums are large, like huge on me. Um, but this fit really nicely. Again, it's a really nice length. And also that one isn't see-through whatsoever, which is, you know, always a bonus with skirts. Finally, I have these trousers, which are probably my favorite thing that I've bought in a long time. I went a little bit crazy with these trousers, but I just thought they were so fun. And like I said, I'm huge into statement trousers. So they're this like burgundy floral print, which floral print is not very me. I don't usually do floral, but they are so comfy and they're really flattering. And then they've got this massive kick flare at the bottom. I just think it's gonna be so fun to style. With that little white top, I thought they'd be really cute. And um, they are my new favorite thing. So I got these in a small because they're quite tight, which means they stretch and they're a little bit more flattering if they are slightly smaller. And this one's only 14 pounds. So I thought that was, I love these. Absolute bargain. So that's everything I have to show you in my massive haul. I hope you guys enjoyed this. Let me know what video you want me to do down below. And I will see you guys on Friday for another weekly vlog. Bye.